Hey there everybody, Red X Parasite here, and welcome back to Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland. In the last episode, our head was in the clouds, and apparently now our head is still in the clouds, so nothing has really changed in the last episode. I see you down there, door. You can't hide from me. I am the great Kirby, discoverer of all secrets. You shall now address me as such whenever I whenever I talk to you. Blocks. They're here. Button. It's there. Peppy Tonic. It's there. I'm so descriptive. Levels of deepness just so deep right now. Deeper than the Marianas Trench. That's pretty deep, for those of you who don't know about it. I am now a block of ice. <laughs> Looks like I'm the coolest thing around. Her, her. And two. It's 5,000 points, but I don't really care much about points. They don't really do much in this game. And again, points don't really do much in lots of games, like in Mario games. Sorry, there's frame drop on the emulator. So, just making sure that what happens and what I perceived were, were true, and I, did, I didn't even get hit there. The sound seemed to be doing fine, of course. Swimming! Sport of true champions! Just being incredibly random. That's all I really have with these videos. I don't, I don't really have much to, much to explain or anything fancy to do. They're just kind of me talking about video games. It's LPing in the truest sense of the word. I'm just commentating on stuff that happens to be happening. This is kind of an interesting section right here. I don't don't really know what to make of it. It's kind of made out of like blue felt. I just stood there and took that like a true man, like a true Kirby. Nifty little one off. Cause I didn't actually start where the door was, so I didn't come out of that door. It's a pretty pretty well hidden secret. Bonkers. Why did why did you? Wow. Fantastic. Oh, I missed. Not that time. You can only evade me so many times. That would be one of those times. But you can evade me, and I'm about to die. If I'm not careful. Unfortunately, I don't think there are any healing items between me and the end of this level. Which is unfortunate. See? I told you, unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Well, what's, what, what's one life in a Kirby game? What is life? Unfortunately, it's not what is love. Otherwise, you know, baby, don't hurt me. No more, no more. But that is where our, where my my tomato was. My tomato. It's gone. No. Why is that a thing? Why, why did I make that a thing? I don't want to know why. I don't know want, want to know why anything I do happens. At least when I'm recording this. Like if I get if I get a good grade on a test, I, I probably know why. It's because you know I studied and, and did well. Because that's just what I do most most of the time. I haven't failed a test in a while, and I should not. I shouldn't say that I'm recording. Not say that I'm recording because you know as soon as I say that it's going to happen. But cro fingers crossed, knock on wood. I haven't failed a test in recent memory. But let's let's not let's not change that. Ooh, look, I can run across gaps. I'm so fancy. Kirby Kirby went to the school of fancy. That's also where this door went. School of Fancy. It knows how to hide itself. Oop, that was close. If you don't react in time, you will die. Although that's probably painstakingly obvious. Especially if it does happen to you. Hey guys, look! Parasol's actually useful! It's crazy. Just a nice, slow, leisurely... Parasol, you suck! I take back what I said about you. 
I don't like you anymore. <laughs> Headlines. Parasol now officially the worst power-up ever. Just wait, New York Times, it'll be there. Level 4. It's all green, and I did not mean to do that. I'll just run off screen and then respawn him. Oh, enemy, I'd like to... I'd like to be you. Well, not be you, but be your ability. Have your ability. So I can get this one up. That is very inconvenient to get otherwise. Ah, that... I hate that enemy placement right there because either you try to jump over him and then you get hit, or you try to burn through him and then you get hit by these spikes. Nah. Here we have another Meta Knight battle, and it has lots of Axemen. Axemen. Not X-Men. Axemen! Ha! Ha! Actually, I think I tried to record this episode earlier, but unfortunately Fraps is being stupid and decided to not actually record, so this is me recording it again. I made a different pun. Still related to axes, though. When I, when I fought these things, and I don't know why I got that ball power up because it's completely... Well, if, you know, if you can use the ball power up here and be successful, I will officially give you an internet because that is just ridiculously hard. There's so many pits there, and there's only one ceiling. Although usually in most parts of the level, there's only one ceiling. What do you see? There are some walls, and some ceilings. Wait! Just one ceiling. Ah, I love you, Caboose. I need, to, I need to watch more Red vs. Blue. More things I need to watch. Because I've, I've seen that episode because one of my friends showed it to me, and I thought it was... Showed it to me. That, that's, the, that's the right tense of that verb. One of my friends showed it to me, and I thought it was kind of funny. But I know, it's been going on for a while. It's just like Doctor Who so much of it that I need to catch up on, and I just don't have the time. That's what I get for going into engineering. Level 5. That was Matrix. That was just pure, pure Matrix right there. Matrix row operations. Why, why am I taking linear algebra? Because I'm smart. I'm smarter than you. I'm kidding. I'm not gonna try to prove my intelligence, especially when I do lots of stupid things in these videos. You better come back. He didn't come back. Get, in order to get this cannon, it's a little tricky. You have to hit those blocks with high jump, and then get fire to light this fuse, and then get in the cannon to be fired. You can't hit your... your you can't suck up those blocks fast enough in order to get there in time. Well, I guess you could probably just suck up the blocks normally, but whatever. I think that's how they intended you to do it, so that's, that's what I'm gonna want to say about it. See, me me proving that I am not very smart when I, when I play. Or at least I try to be, and then I fail. But you guys can't tell the difference, so I'm not gonna try to bother and prove to you that it that there's a difference between me failing and me being stupid. Fire! Fireballs! Yum! My voice cracked. That hasn't happened to me in a while. My voice is incredibly low. And so if I try to do anything like that... Yeah. Voice cracks. If you haven't hit puberty yet, look forward to it. It'll happen. That will also happen in your life. You will get hit by something <laughs> in a video game. Unless you're one of those weird people that can go through their entire life without getting hit by anything, then you don't have anything to worry about. Otherwise, you might you might be a little concerned. Level six. Oh, okay. So I, I have I have a bone to pick with this level right here, and. Actually, I, I can't. Now that I went into the level, I can't. I can't leave it. But in order to get the secret in this level, you have to have a certain certain power-ups. And if I get lucky, wow! If you suck up two enemies at the same time as you see there. You can get a random assortment of 
power-ups. Not, not power-ups, abilities. But, you get a random assortment of abilities, and of course the one that I get when I suck up two wheels is... Wheel. Yeah. As I was saying, though, in order to get the secret in this level, and I'll, sh I'll show it off here, it's, it's coming right up, but in order to get the secret, you have to have either UFO or Hammer, because you have to have a way to destroy these kind of platinum blocks. Platinum's not very... No, well, actually, platinum is somewhat durable. Well, they're not made out of aluminum, that's for sure. But why am I talking about metal durability. They're made- I don't- it doesn't matter what they're made out of. Point is, you have to have hammer in order to break them underwater. Or UFO, if you manage to have UFO. But anyways... I need to stop saying that. I noticed that I've been saying that way too much in the past two episodes of this. Regardless. The thing that I've found the easiest way to get hammers to go into this coliseum here, this arena. And I'm not here for the Maxim Tomato, which is what the kind of prize is for doing those. I'm actually here for the hammer ability. And something makes me think that they probably put this here, put that arena there on purpose and made it give you hammer on purpose. Because they did this thing where they made the secret super annoying. Now I just have to hold on to this for the basically the entire level. Which, you know, given given my past experience with trying to do stuff like that, you know, I'll I'll mess it up somehow. Ha! Ah, reverse psychology game. What you gonna do about it? And the game will do just that. See, the game doesn't let me have anything. I can't even have one one bit of smug satisfaction game will not let me have that. And now I wish I could swing my hammer underwater so I could get to the door that's hidden down here. And hit the button. The game actually tantalizes you with the button. You can get into that door here, this one on the right side, from from this right door, and so you can see it, and see where the button is, but then you can't get to it. That just makes it even worse. It's salt in the wound, man. Salt in the wound. We I haven't gotten any one this episode. Unless my memory's been terribly bad, but I don't I don't think so. Moving on to the boss. This boss is a drill with drills on its drill. Yo dog, I heard you like drills, so we put drills in your drills on your drills. Donna drills. This thing, other than drilling its way through the level, which you can see that it's doing, it will spit out two kinds of bullets at you. One of them, the brown ones, will give you hammer, which I already have from the previous level of the boss. And if you would have spit out one of the red ones, those will give you sleep if you swallow them, which is bad, because he will try to off-screen you, basically. So you keep on moving, but you won't move, and then you fall in a pit or get crushed by the screen, and that's basically how you die here, other than getting hit by the boss itself. I think that's about it for that boss, and I think that's going to be it for this episode as well. Thanks, guys, for watching. See you in the next one. Red X Parasite, signing out.